Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Silent Core and welcome to another Assassin's Creed Syndicate video. So just yesterday I uploaded 9 minutes of uh, gameplay from this game so I'd really recommend checking that out. It's a really interesting video and you can see some developer commentary so I'll put a link on screen if you missed that one. But in this video I'm going to be going through 10 new um, confirmed facts for this game. So I've gone through the gameplay in quite in depth detail and also gone through a bunch of blog posts about this game so hopefully I can confirm you guys some new information you didn't already know. So getting into fact number one is that you can actually play as two different assassins this time. You can actually play as Jacob or his twin sister Evie Fry. And it sounds like they're going to be played quite differently. Evie is uh, quite tactical, resourceful, whereas Jacob is a bit more of a brawler. He's brutal and impulsive. And the creative director on this game also said that Jacob is a complete brawler. He's going to be the leader of the London criminal underworld, whereas Eve is going to be much stealthier and she's really intelligent and witty. The second confirmed fact is that you're actually going to be able to switch between these two characters at any point in the open world. And this is something I'm pretty excited about, um, especially with the GTA style character switching. Fact number three is that there's a stealth mode. In Assassin's Creed Unity, um, there was a kind of hard style snap cover, um, whereas in this game it's going to be a little more seamless and uh, you'll notice Jacob will actually take off his top hat and pull up his hood when he enters uh, stealth mode. There's a brand new tool been added into the game called the Rope Launcher, which has been described as actually a game changer. So this will basically propel you to new heights at a faster pace, and even let you create a zip line between buildings and avoid the streets altogether. It's also noted that the Rope Launcher can be used at any time on any building, and it becomes a very powerful tool in the hands of either, either assassin you play as. Fan number 5, there's been a bunch of new weapons confirmed. Jacob will actually have a 6 shooter revolver throwing knives and also confirmed is a uh, kukri, I have no idea how to pronounce that one, it's basically a curved blade from Nepal. Jacob can also make use of a set of knuckle dusters, I assume these can deal some pretty brutal damage uh, when melee brawling. There's going to be new vehicles such as the horse drawn carriages which you can actually hijack GTA style. Fact number 8 is actually a bit of an interesting one, there's going to be no multiplayer in Assassin's Creed Syndicate, Ubisoft has confirmed it will be a single player only video game. Ubisoft CEO went on to say that they want to spend all of their time making sure the single player is as good as possible. Which to be honest I'm completely fine with, I tend to always play the Assassin's Creed games solo in my own time anyway. Fact number 9 is quite a brief one, it's all we really have so far and that's that a tavern will actually function as the base of operations in London and this will be your assassin's base. And on to the 10th and last confirmed fact, and that's that you can actually work with London street gangs to help take control of the city. Ubisoft have also said that many of the activities and side quests are actually going to revolve around winning over these various gangs in London's diverse district. So I'm sure making good relationships with gangs will really help you take over the city. So there you go guys, that was my top 10 Assassin's Creed Syndicate confirmed facts. Hope you guys enjoyed, maybe learned something new, let me know in the comments what you think of this game so far. Don't forget to leave the video a like if you did enjoy, it really helps out my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one.